Bismillah. Hello, how are you today? Today I'm gonna to see with you how to create LS factor map. But you can use it when you want to quantify the erosion using the USL or OSL model and uh, <coughs> using also ArcGIS. So first of all, you need to have the dam of your watershed. For me, I have uh, the dam of my watershed. That <coughs> that is uh, the dam of my watershed. So you need to save your work here in your file if you will, if you want to work that and click double double click on that and select standard deviation yes and apply ok so first of all you need to quantify or push fill sinks ok completed so that's the fill sinks now then you need to flow calculate flow direction okay then you need to flow accumulation So this is the flow accumulation of my watershed. So you need now to calculate the slope. The slope, so you need to go to our toolbox. From the list of our toolbox, you need to go to spatial analysis tools, surface and go to slope. Slope and you need to select watershed dam and calculate it in percent like this and click OK you're gonna wait something so when you get uh, the result of slope calculation so this is the result of slope calculation you, you can notice that uh, there are uh, slope from 0 to 66 so what you need now to do you can observe from the map which is approximately in green you can notice that uh, that uh, The slope is between 0 and 3. Between 0, the majority of slopes is between 0 and 3. So you need just to keep that in mind because we will need it in future step. So then you need to go to Map Algebra and select Raster Calculator. In Raster Calculator, you need to use this equation to use it in the slope or LS factor creation so I need to create LS equal uh, accumulation so flow accumulation in resolution resolution for me in my case I have a, a dam of 90 meter resolution so I need to type 19 meter. If you have a dam of another resolution, so you need to insert the resolution of your dam which you are using. So divide on 22.1, 22.1, 22.1, like this. 
in n so this factor is important as i told as i told before that from the map you can notice that the majority of my slope map is between 0 and 3 from the legend here so you need to use the table so the n value you can answer 0 for 4 slopes above of 5 percent 0.4 for slopes between 3 and 5 percent 0.3 from slopes from 1 and 3 percent 02 for slopes under 1 so as I told before my slopes is in the, this range so I gonna use 02 zero two as n value so you need to this is the symbol of power in zero two like this then you need in I need to add that like this in So when you finish the writing of the equation, that's it will be your equation. LS in flow accumulation in 90 the resolution divided on 22.1 in 02 it's the m value. It's the m value 02 uh, in 0.065 or 0.045 in slope then plus 0.065 in slope then in slope then so what you need to do is just to click ok and wait something uh, some time to get your ls factor map so this is the ls factor map I'm gonna just to use another uh, another color for my map. We'll use this, and that is my LS factor map. I can just write here LS factor. So I hope that I was clear in my explanation and thank you for your attention and bye bye.